Hi, I'm Jack from LegalExpert.co.uk and in today's video, I'm going to be taking a look at our Workplace Slip 444 Personal Injury Claim Checklist. We'll be going over some of the things we believe you should do if you've been involved in a Workplace Slip 444 Personal Injury Incident. At Legal Expert, we're rated 4.8 out of 5 stars and we offer 100% no win, no fee claim service, which means that there's nothing to pay if you lose. Get the maximum compensation that you deserve. We have specialist solicitors with up to 30 years experience. In order to find out if you can claim compensation, call our free phone helpline now on 0800 652 7676 or visit our live chat service at legalexpert.co.uk. Once we get to the end of our checklist, let us know what you think in the comments below. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe as we'll be uploading more content just like this on a regular basis. So you've been involved in a workplace slip trip or fall personal injury incident and you wish to bring a claim for compensation but you don't know what you need to do. Well thankfully you're in the right place as we are about to go through our checklist of steps which we believe will be useful when bringing a workplace slip trip or fall personal injury claim. So without further ado let's take a look. Step 1. Make sure you're safe after your workplace slip trip or fall personal injury incident. In the immediate aftermath of an accident, your priority should be to ensure your own safety. If you're injured, the last thing that you want to do is run the risk of being exposed to any further danger, which could make your current injuries even worse. We understand that you may find yourself in a situation where other individuals have been involved in the accident and you may feel that the right thing to do is to assist them or seek assistance for them despite your own injuries. Whilst we can't advise on what the correct actions to take in any specific circumstances will be, if you do find yourself in this situation, the best way for you to ensure that you're in a position to help others will be by ensuring your own safety first. Step 2. Report the workplace slip trip or fall personal injury incident. When bringing a claim for compensation, it's important that you report the accident in the relevant way, whether that be to the police or by ensuring that an accident report form is completed. This differs depending on the circumstances of your accident. Step 3. Seek medical assistance following workplace slip trip or fall personal injury incident. Once your safety has been ensured and you've reported your accident, it's important that you have your injuries assessed by a medical professional. This will ensure that you'll receive appropriate medical care and treatment in order to assist your recovery. Step 4. Gather evidence. Now that you're hopefully on the road to recovery and in a position to start thinking about bringing a claim for compensation, in order to bring a successful claim, you must be able to show that the incident you were involved in was caused due to the negligence of others. So, make a note of exactly when the accident happened, whether there were any witnesses, if the incident was caught on CCTV, and any other details about the accident which you think may be important. Remember the accident report form and reports from your medical assessment that we mentioned in the previous steps? Those may also be used as evidence, so make a note of where and when those were completed Step 5. Seek legal assistance. In our opinion, this is one of the most vital steps you can take, as you'll be seeking the help of someone who has the experience and knowledge of handling compensation claims just like yours. Now, in order to be able to bring a claim without the burden of worry in regards to things like upfront fees and covering the cost of legal services if you lose, we recommend that you enlist the services of a no-win, no-fee claims solicitor. Here at LegalExpert.co.uk, we have experience in dealing with workplace slip triple fall personal injury claims, and we offer 100% no win, no fee claims, which means that as long as you're honest in your account of the details of the accident, then there isn't any upfront fees, and if your case was to lose, well, there wouldn't be a penny to pay. We offer a completely free zero obligation consultation, where we'll aim to help clarify what your options are. Call now on 0800 652 7676 or use our around the clock live chat service at legalexpert.co.uk. Our team may be able to discuss average payout for slip and fall UK, how much compensation for a fall UK 
Accident at Work Gov UK, Fall at Work UK, Accident at Work Claim Calculator, Injury at Work, What is a Personal Injury Claim and Personal Injury Claims UK. Don't forget to subscribe as we'll be uploading helpful videos just like this one on a regular basis or you can head over to legalexpert.co.uk where you can read community questions on our forum, get free advice on our live chat and seek assistance for compensation on a no-win, no-fee basis with your personal injury claim.